getting ready for a wedding because Mr. Agung, whom I first introduced in this video, sent me a text message. It says, on Sunday, 6 November, my family, and you are one of them, have the wedding invitation. So today, I'm heading to a wedding. It's really sweet that Mr. Agung would think of me like a family member. I just realized I look like I'm dressed for a funeral, not a wedding. Oops. Oh well, it's my favorite shirt. Walking through a traffic jam. <laughs> Time to go. Bye bye. Okay. Thank you. The wedding was really fun. Kind of a long drive. We took about an hour to get there. We got there, shook hands with the bride and groom, ate some food, and then we left. We were there for maybe 20 or 30 minutes. That's how you do weddings in Indonesia. You're in, you're out. No problem. I'll stop recording for today, and tomorrow I'll talk about my own marriage. As a volunteer here in Indonesia, we work with local teaching counterparts. That relationship is almost like an arranged marriage. We are two people forced to be together. So no, I'm not actually married. What I have is more like a hardcore bromance. Hi guys, I am Mr. Muglis. And we're going to class. Today we're giving the kids vocabulary tests. We do it one by one so they can't cheat. Keeps them honest. We will go to the canteen? Yes, we will go to the canteen. Time to hang out. Let's go! Yeah. The canteen is our favorite place to hang out yeah. in a big time. We like to drink coffee and chat. Time to go back to class. After school we have English club, then we are free. I'm glad I got to introduce you to Pop Mohlis today. He's a really great guy. He's a great friend and he's fun to teach with. I'm gonna miss him when I go back to America. I think that's enough recording for today. So I want to say, take care and keep creating. Bye bye.